Alright, what's up everybody, and today we are going to be talking about why Kevin Pritchard should already be fired two weeks into his job. Alright, so today we're going to be talking about the Paul George trade again. As you guys all know, I like to talk about the Paul George trade. So, I think I already told I told this about, about this in my last Paul George video, which was me reacting to him getting traded. Um, Kevin Pritchard should, I don't know if he should already be fired, like I said in the beginning, but he definitely is not as good as Larry Bird, honestly, because Larry Bird's a god, but, so basically, the Celtics offered us Jay Crowder, Avery Bradley, two 2018 first round picks for Paul George. Now, there are some people that are telling me that that was not finalized, which means that the Celtics didn't technically send us that offer, which means we couldn't accept it. I don't know if I believe that's true or not, but if that is the case, then there's no point in making this video. But this is assuming that that is not the case. So we ended up taking Victor Oladipo and some guy, again, I don't know his name, I'm not going to try and pronounce it, um, from the Thunder for Paul George, which Avery Bradley and Jay Crowder are easily, easily better than both of them. And we get picks out of it. And they're both getting paid less, so I don't get why we didn't accept it. The only reason top NBA analysts like Stephen A. Smith, um, well, he's basically the only one, but he was saying that this shows that Kevin Pritchard did not want to help people in our conference. In other words, he wanted to trade into the Thunder so that the Celtics couldn't get better, which makes sense because the Bulls did the exact same thing. They traded Jimmy Butler to the T-Wolves for a pile of crap just so that he wouldn't go to the Celtics or the Cavs, which... In the long run, it's probably a smart move, but right now when we're a rebuilding team, we probably needed the better option, especially if Paul George was most likely going to leave Indiana or even, you know, the Celtics or OKC or wherever he would have landed, he most likely was going to leave. So I think this just kind of shows that Kevin Pritchard was assuming that Paul George would stay with that team and that he didn't want to help out our conference. Um, but I, me and my friend, we got a saying going on. Hashtag BBB and not Big Baller brand, LeVar Ball. But bring back Bird. I want Larry Bird to come back. I don't think you will. I kind of want him to come back, though. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you like this video and you want to see more. We did a Dryzen Drock Easter Egg stream and an Origin stream uh, whenever the other day. Probably... I don't know when this is going up, but we did do that. That was very successful, and me and Devin and possibly Gavin are going to be trying to do more streams like the DE1, trying to complete the Easter eggs on Black Ops 3, DLC 1 through 4. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Like I said, don't forget to like, subscribe, and don't forget to follow me on Twitter, at It's Blue Thunder, and I also made Instagram. Follow me on that, It's Blue Thunder on there. Hope you guys did enjoy this video, though. I'm out.